Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video will be my nighttime routine. If you guys want to see my nighttime routine, then keep watching. So the first thing that I do is brush my teeth. You want to make sure that you have a really good dental routine. My dentist always told me to make sure that you're brushing your teeth every morning and every night and between meals. And typically you want to brush your teeth for four minutes straight. And I like to use my electric toothbrush because I think it just gets down in there. So I brush my teeth first. After I brush my teeth, I want to make sure that I prep my face. So I'm just rinsing off my face to get ready to do my facial routine. And before I do that, I have to put my hair in a ponytail because if not, my hair would tend to get wet and I don't want it to revert back because then I have to rewash my hair and reapply heat. And we don't want to add extra heat if we don't have to. So let's pin that hair on up. Next, I'm using the Urban Skin RX Facial Soap. I actually, this is my first time using this soap. I've heard really good reviews on it from helping remove dark spots and acne skin. So I've been getting a lot of bumps lately and I've seen a lot of discoloration and dark spots on my cheek area. So I really wanna remove that. So hopefully this soap helps remove that. So I'm just washing my face with this soap and I'm actually gonna wash my face over again. So I'm gonna rinse my face off and I'm gonna reapply the soap over again just to make sure that I did remove all the dirt from underneath my skin. I'm about to go in with my mask. I use the Aztec clay mask mixed with apple cider vinegar. They actually tell you instructions on the tube to make sure that you mix the Aztec clay with apple cider vinegar. This is my very first time using this um, clay mask as well, but it's supposed to do the exact same thing when it comes to helping remove dark spots and brighten your knees, your skin. So I'm really excited to have this new skincare routine to see how it works for me because typically a lot of skincare routines don't really work for my skin as far as removing my dark spots. So I'm very excited um, to use this and I've actually heard that apple cider vinegar was really good at removing, at removing sorry, dark spots. So I'm pretty sure that this skincare routine is going to work. If you guys want me to do an updated skincare routine in more detail, I can do that for you guys. Just let me know in the comments down below. Also, if you guys want me to do an update on how this skincare routine is working for me, let me know in the comments down below as well and I will film a video for you guys in a couple of months after I try this product out. Also, if you guys have used this product, let me know as well because I want to know if it works for you and any other hacks that you can help give me for removing my dark spots. Next, I'm going to check my emails and just try to um, help myself when it comes to my YouTube channel. I like to do this as well because every single day you want to better yourself. So you always want to make sure that you're doing extra work to make sure that you are achieving what you want to do in your goals. So I like to take a lot of notes down and stuff like that. So I do that at night as well. And now I'm about to get ready to clean up for the night. I like to put away the dishes that I used for the previous day or the day of or the same day that I already cleaned. So I'm just putting those up so I can wash the dishes that I use today. Doing this makes it less work for you so you don't have to wait till all the dishes like pile up and now you have a whole bunch of dishes to wash. With this way it just helps you have less. So the saying less is more is the best. So less work, less time wasted. So let's wash these dishes. After 
I finish washing all my dishes, I actually like to go in and wipe down the countertops in the sink just to remove all the residue and the stains and the bacteria from when you were cooking. So you always want to do that to make sure you keep a sanitary workspace. Now um, we're going to eat tonight. It's pizza. Leon brought home some pizza, so that's what we're going to eat. Now I'm getting ready for my nighttime to go to sleep. So one thing that I do is I like to read a good book. This really helps get my mind at ease and also it's always good to gain extra knowledge. So after I finish reading my book and drinking my tea, I like to just watch TV until it's time to go to sleep. So thank you guys so much for watching my nighttime routine. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, posse.